Hey guys, what's going on? It's been a while. It's uh, Jay the Pepper Dude. Uh, first things first, I know the audio is not going to be in sync. Uh, I do apologize for that. Uh, it's not my fault. It's uh, <laughs> it's my computer. What you expect? It's it's a Mac. So yeah, if it's out of sync, I do apologize. Uh, I also want to apologize because it's been a while since I've done a review. Uh, I've been busy. Uh, I had to bring my plants in for the winter. And I got about three, yeah, two, maybe three more reviews left. Um, before I get into it, there is a uh, couple things. Um, well, a few. One, I'm going to be growing the Carolina Reaper. That's my new iPhone, by the way. Um, hopefully, I'll be getting a business going within this year, so within 2012, 2013. And if you recall last time, I'll have the link right here or on the link on the thing below, uh, I did a review of a pepper that was a mystery, and a lot of people were saying it was an ahi dolce chato or a mozzano. Well, I did some research and finally figured out it was actually a Trinidad Congo habanero. So, anyway, um, and I actually stumbled across a video that Ted Barris did. Uh, he found a, a nicer way, a better way to combat the heat of the chili. And I'll get into that in a minute. But right now, I've been wanting to get to this one for the longest time. But to be honest with you, I have been scared out of my mind to try this one. Um, I've been saving it for a while. Well, not for a while, but at least a week. And, you know, I just, I got to get this done. Because if not, then it's going to haunt me forever. Um, but what I have here, I don't know if you can see this very well. This is the Trinidad Scorpion Maruga Red. Um, Jim, uh, thank you, Jim Duffy, for the seeds. Uh, these produced a very good, uh, a very good uh, produce, a very good set of peppers. Uh, I had a little uh, problem earlier in the year with cutworms, but thank God it's been taken care of. So yeah, I got this, and I'm doing a rematch with the Douglas. So anyway, um. I'm honestly not thrilled trying this one because it is unofficially the hottest you can get. It can range up to a certain 1.3 to maybe 2 million on the Scoville heat unit. So I'm really, really concerned with this. And yeah, I'm, I'm not thrilled. I'm really not. But, you know, <laughs> you got to do what you got to do. So, you know, just in case... I do have my gag bucket. Uh, yes, I'm sitting on the floor just in case. Um, I do have water to wash down the pod. And the one thing that, uh, you know, I, I do want to give a shout out to Ted Barris if this works. Um, he said that there was one way to cool off the heat, and that would be this ain't milk, this is uh, eggnog. So I'm willing to give that a try. Oh, I'm so nervous about this. So. Without further ado, this is the uh, Trinidad Scorpion Maruga Red. I'm going to go ahead and take the stem off on this. Mm. This smells brutal. This really does smell brutal. Um, I want to delay talking for a little while. Or I want to delay putting this in my mouth because I... I mm. <laughs> um... Yeah, as you can see, it's uh, painful. <sighs> Here it is, guys. The Trinidad Scorpion, Maruga Red. Cheers. Just like the Butch Teeter sheet.
there's still some of it in my mouth. <clears throat> really floral, but like the butch tea, the heat's already there. Ugh. I'm going to give this a shot. <clears throat> oh. Wow. This broke the barrier. I don't think this is enough. My throat's on fire right now. Lips and mouth are on fire. Right here, uh, right here, it's just, uh, uh, hurts to talk. M my tongue feels like it's swelling up. so hot it's really hot it's I know water ain't gonna help, but like right here in the throat the back of the throat right here in the mouth lips tongue I was in Atlanta I was in Atlanta on Friday seeing a friend of mine's uh, band I'll also provide a link if you want to check them out. 
But when I told him what I was doing with these, oh, when I told him what I was doing with these, you know, just reviewing, doing foods and whatnot, um, hit my stomach already. When I told him what I was doing with this, you know, me and him talked and I told him like what the, but the peppers that I and almost every other pepper had grow, the marugas, the reapers, the douglas, the ghost chilies. These are peppers you don't want to, like, this is something you wouldn't want to wish on an enemy. It's really not. Ugh. I mean, it's just, uh, Ugh. Sorry. Ugh. Ugh. I mean, it'd be, I understand the whole, you know, oh, I want my enemies to suffer thing. Uh, if you know my beliefs, I oppose that, so, but I mean, um, this is something you, I, I don't ever want to wish on an enemy. This is painful. <laughs> um, but, yeah, heat's starting to die down just a little bit. Um, my stomach is killing me. I know it's a short and sweet review. Uh, I can tell you this much right now. I'm starting to not feel very good. My stomach is on fire. <clears throat> and I mean, I even took some Mylanta. Oh! I even took some Mylanta even before I, uh, before I did this, and it's breaking through the Mylanta. So, um, hopefully the next one I'm going to do is a toss-up between the ghost chilies I grew and the Douglas Ray match. So, um, I don't know, check, check, check out my YouTube channel, subscribe. Uh, I'm not doing this for popularity, I'm just doing this because, you know, it's there. I enjoy doing it. I like being the sadomasochist. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, this is uh, Jay the Pepper Dude signing off. This is not even about maybe 15, 20 minutes into it. <clears throat> it ravaged me from the inside out. Um, the only thing I could think about was puking. And, ugh! I just got done puking, like, not even, like, two minutes ago, three minutes ago. Ugh. I mean, that was an awesome pepper, but nothing helped. Not even the, uh, Mylanta. So, ugh. I don't know if you can see. Ugh. I guess not. Um, just... Stay tuned for more updates. Uh, I got, like I said, maybe two, possibly three more reviews left, or actually two more, or just one, one to two more left, and then that's it for the winter season until more comes in, or <clears throat> I don't know what. But um, once again, this is Jay the Pepper Dude signing off.